cutest dog. He's the eldest son of seven kids, and... Uh, Saki, this seems like it could go on for a while. How about we give her the flyer in Vamoose? Yeah, that sounds like a plan. Hey, I don't suppose Crimson Plum's on this flyer anywhere, is he? Huh? What flyer? Oh, yes! That's him right there! That's my husband -o. Wait, does this shop have the limited edition figurine of him in stock? Yo, that's like super mega ultra rare! Hmm, maybe it's overstock from canceled pre-orders. All I know is, if you want it, now's your chance. Whoa, for realsies? I need to get over there like yesterday! Never thought I'd be able to find my boy in figure form. Thanks for the Joho dog! This'll show the world who the real Crimson Plumber is! Oh. Well, that was certainly a thing. What'd I tell you? This is, as they say, my jam. Just take a good look at the figurines, then see if you change your tune. When they're done well, they're art. You don't understand, you, you won't even give them a chance. Yeah, yeah, but those characters with their skimpy outfits, the stores that sell them are totally just boys clubs. It's all just a bunch of pervy junk. Why would I want to take a good look at crap like that? Oh, would you listen to yourself? So close-minded. Let's go talk to those two, shall we? Time out, you two. Who the? First off, here, take one of these, both of you. Huh? What's this? Some kind of flyer? <gasps> it's got an Opal Plum figurine on it! This store is working hard to be a one-stop destination for all the kinds of figurines women enjoy. Oh, no kidding. I had no idea there was a place like this around here. See, I told you. Figurines for women are all the rage lately. You're all about Opal Plum, right? You want to go take a look together? Yeah, I guess so. If they've got Opal Plum figurines there, they can't be all that bad. All right, that's what I'm screaming. <laughs> um, thank you. This could be the start of something beautiful and it's all because of your flyer. Not at all, thank you. We look forward to seeing you at the store. Nice job. Yeah, and we bagged a guy customer while we were at it too. Whew. The last flyer has found a home. Nice work. A little too nice, in a way. How come you're so good at this again? I didn't actually say, but it's because I do this kind of thing a lot at my part-time job. Huh? You have a job? Yep. I work at a sports bar on my days off from school. It's a pretty popular place. We have so many customers, I guess I'm just used to meeting demands and schmoozing. Hmm. Interesting. Probably also doesn't hurt that the place's uniform is super cute, though. But never mind that. Considering your chosen profession, I imagine all this work talk isn't really doing it for you. In other words, take some time and find a job, dingus. Hey, you're a pretty neat-like little thing yourself. I don't see you working. Being adorable is my job, I'll have you know. I'll show you adorable, you little... That's enough of that now. Let's head back to the figurine shop and see if business is booming. With all these new customers, the manager ought to be happy as a clam.
Hey, you're back. Yep, doing good business now, I hope. <laughs> if by good you mean great, then yeah. Thanks to you folks, this place is hopping. We've had a veritable cavalcade of female customers, and figurines are just flying off the shelves. I haven't seen this kind of business in such a long time. I'm so happy, I could cry. That's great. I'm really glad we could be of some help to you. Thank you both so much. I don't know how I could ever repay you. He's sure looking chipper. Mm-hmm. A job well done. And we didn't even have to contend with any weird delusions along the way. As always, Saki is the bestest. Oh, hey. Glad I caught you before you left. This is for you, as a token of my appreciation. Hmm? <laughs> what the heck? Saki, did he just see Pinku? That's a good question. Hmm. Must have up and left. Pity. This definitely raises some questions. Oh, well. Forgive a poor figurine man his imagination. I just thought I saw a cute little fairy in here. <laughs> Probably something I ate coming back to haunt me. Anyway, I wanted to give you a token of my thanks. This is for you. Wow, thank you very much. Come again anytime. Because of you, this place is going to do just fine. Hey, am I on figurine shop impossible? <laughs> oh, forget it. Hey, Saki, you don't think that guy could be a deluser, do you? Well, he did notice Pinkoon, so that's a pretty reasonable question. But, eh... Uh... I don't think there's anything to worry about. Based on his reaction, I'm sure he's good. Man, are you feeling okay? He was mighty shocked, wasn't he? Pain Coon, you can't just be popping out as you please. You know better. I know, but you could have just pretended I was Sakura Plum. Yeah, that's it. There is no Sakura Plum. Yeah? It's fine, though. Anyway, before we leave, I think I'll go buy a figurine to keep us company. If you get my drift. Ew. No, no, no. You're not one of those guys, are you? What? No, I'm talking about her. You know. Uh, no, I don't. She who glitters even among the stars above. Pure Venus, your favorite? Oh, that's okay. We don't need her. Can we stop for a sec and buy stuff? to have seen a man in a pink cape anywhere around here, would you? Oh, the man in pink. Yes, I have actually. He went around the corner over that way, probably headed to Main Street. What? Thank you very much. Trying to sell me a painting, I'm not interested. N no, I'm not 
an Artlian, I swear. I just have a question for you. Have you seen a man wearing a pink cape anywhere around here? A pink cape? Oh, it has to be... You've seen him? It has to be some clever scheme to sell me your paintings. <laughs> well, fool me once, shame on you. Fool me twice, 